Hey bro. You know, I recently completed a two days of training. Yeah, it was five hours each day. You know what is exciting about this training is it costed one thousand dollars, means sixty thousand rupees. What was it about? Yeah, it was about creating presentations. You mean PPT? Yeah, PPT. PowerPoint slides. Yeah. Okay, enough suspense. Now I'll tell you why this session was so expensive and it costed 60,000 rupees or $1,000. Okay, the training name was Duarte Resonate and I will try to explain why this training was so expensive. Whether it worth or not, you wanna decide it. I will be telling you each advantage and disadvantage of this training. So let's jump into the video and I will also tell you as well, okay? And if you do not find it good, then it's fine. Okay, so now let me show you their website and the actual cost of this course. As soon as I Google Duarte Resonate, I can open the first website, which is Duarte Resonate. Let's go to the training and then Resonate. Let's come here and check the price, which is live online workshop is at $990 and 360, 395. So if I do this and if I convert CAD to INR, okay, let's go here. It is 60,000 rupees. Okay, now you know the actual cost of the course, which is $1,000 or maybe 60,000 INR, which is quite expensive for the two days of training. And if you know the exact agenda or the outcome of this, uh, like the workshop, I I'll leave it on you, whether you find it worth or not. If I have to explain it in a single line, what is Dua to resonate is, I would say like it is an immersive training program, which help you to become a master at creating the persuasive presentation, which can captivate your audience. Okay, now if I have to explain you in a simple term, so let's take a scenario. Have you ever think about executive kind of people are giving presentation in the company where they have to enable or implement an idea at a company level or like intercompany or maybe between two companies. So those kind of presentations are like very, should be very precise, should be very uh, to the point. Okay. And the idea should be really clear on those, on those things. So Dorothy Resonate says that if you want to implement or like make such kind of presentation, just take our course. So this is Duarte Resonate, they say it. So if I have to explain it in a single term, what is the main agenda of the Duarte Resonated? So they, they say that if you want to express an idea, if you have the idea, uh, so you should be like explaining it and connecting it with a story because people don't remember the stats, people don't remember the, the things, but they remember a story, okay? So storytelling is the main agenda of the Duarte Resonate. So they say, uh, if you have to present an idea, just connect it with a story and then express it. So people will remember for a longer period of time. This is the main highlight of the Duarte Resonate training is. Now they have divided the Resonate training into four sections. So what they do, just pick up the idea, brainstorm whatever the idea coming to your mind, just write those down, categorize those, simplify those and then keep refining keep refining until you uh, like until you reach to the point where you have the exact point which is sellable point of your idea and if i have to explain you with the presentation i don't think so i can uh, like show you the docs they have shared with us maybe this is kind of a copyright so i will be explaining you by creating my ppt and i will explain you in a very short way that it is nothing so complicated but I'm not saying that you should not take it if your company is allowing. Because for me, I didn't spend any money. My company sponsored this uh, for me and from uh, like for different people in my company. So we got lucky and could get this work free. I can give you a very quick and very best example. Nowadays, we are watching reels. So if somebody has to explain you one tool, maybe a one AI tool, then what they do, they make a story out of it. Like two people are talking, one say like, I'm facing this kind of problem, how should I solve it? Then the other guy comes and then he says like, okay, you can solve this with this way. So now what exactly this happened? They made a story and the other guy came into the picture and resolved the issue. So now you can relate with the idea. If the guy was coming directly and selling you like, and telling you like, okay, this is the tool used to remove the background of your picture. That's fine. This is good. But what is more engaging? The, the first one, right? The other guy is like struggling, troubling with removing the image background and the other guy jumps in, asks the query, asks the issue and then solve it. You relate to that much. Okay. So this is how 
you do the storytelling and okay guys so for some security reasons or copyright thing i cannot show you the exact files they have shared with us we were doing it all together like within the session she was or the instructor was telling us and we were keep on doing it and we were going to some breakout rooms for like three or four people because there were a bunch of more people were there so we were discussing the things what we were doing into the presentation it was not the actual presentation which we are like making like adding images graphs and all it was just to bring out the best from the idea to the actual picture so i can show you here i have just created uh, some kind of like a uh, document which is Uh, replicating the actual crux of the resonate okay uh, so here there are three things as i also mentioned like content brainstorm key messages and persuasive presentation so content brainstorm is what so they have given us a set of steps where we what we have to do just write down all the possible ideas so if you have one idea just write down all the possible things related to the idea your problems uh, the action steps required to achieve that and what will happen after you achieve this okay so something if you like you are brainstorming your content you are just bringing out everything whatever possible related to your idea related to the solution which you are going to provide to the company okay and the key messages after that what you were doing so let me just go to the next slide so next slide says like beginning middle and end so what you were doing you were writing down everything possible related to that idea into this section you were adding like uh, small stickies and then the middle section you were adding some action step what you going to do to achieve those kind of things and in the end we were writing what is or how it is going to help after you implement this uh, possible solution so if you notice here one thing key messages this key messages was the categorization of your brainstorm messages so like you have written 10 messages to solve a problem like this was a problem this is a problem this is a problem and now these are the action steps i'm going to do so and this is the profit which is going to be implemented after you resolve this problem okay so so like if you have three messages related to the problem statement you were writing one major key messages and you were just tagging those within this key message okay like this one the same goes for the middle and and for the last one so this is basically after the end you will say that these are the benefits i will uh, deliver these are the action steps these are the beginning problem statements or ideas or problem statements we can say okay this is all in all the resonated if i have to explain it in a very short way so all you do is like you have to write you have to refine you have to keep on refining until you reach to the point where you find the action step where you find the possible benefit of implementing this idea this is not the final presentation which you can present to anybody because you are not going to present the brainstorm ideas to the client so this is to help you to bring out the best of that idea and then you have to put that into a separate presentation to uh, deliver to the client or because of the security reasons and copyright i cannot show you their actual actual content which is not allowed to us so that's why i created this simple one so you can understand these are the three major things and this is the possible outcome outcome will be to the fourth or fifth slide there are only like five or six slides at the end of the slides we were reaching to the place where we were able to find out okay this is our idea these are the action step these are the benefits and this is what we have to do so this is technically the dwarse resonated okay guys thank you so much for watching this video i hope it helps and i saved you one 60000 rupees or 1000 dollars if you ask me personally whether this course should cost 1000 dollars or 60000 rupees i would say no it should be like way cheap than this one i don't know how they calculated or defined the course fees like this so expensive but i would say if you don't know anything about creating presentations if you are struggling just watch some youtube videos and if your pocket justify you can just take this course okay and you can just uh, follow me thank you so much for watching